سارة السلام عليكم جايز سو بدينا نوصل لمبوصل و وي هيدينج تو ذا كابا اند ان شاء الله ذا بلان از فيرست ويز عمره ذات وي ويل دو زياره ذا كابا ذن وي ويل بروسيد تو دو طواف اخت طواف اي بليف وي نيد نفل اخت ذا ذن وي جو تو سفر مروه كومبليت سيف راوند اند ان شاء الله اخت ذا يور بروذر از غانا جو بولد So we we'll look forward to completing that inshallah very very soon uh, and you can see behind me as well the groups walking and you can probably hear loads of coaches honestly absolutely hectic here a day or two before Ramadan inshallah and we'll continue we've got brother Ifzal here on the on side of me who's joined us on the trip he's excited and tired but inshallah we'll catch up with some of the lads later on So as we walk towards the Haram uh, one thing that we've been told by the group is that don't look down and wait for the moment when you look to see the Kaaba at the best view you do not know when Malik al Maut will come and take his own the reason we've travelled to the Umrah and complete it is so we can do Ziyarat of the Kaaba as well we should look and seek to complete any absolutely any opportunity to get the best view whether that's a glance God be now Nizarat Akikano inshallah and complete the Umrah overall as well you know there's a very big social media trend where a lot of people wait and play this like thing where they look down at the floor and then wait like a moment no you don't need to do that the main thing is look direct and seek the opportunity subhanallah when you think about that you've traveled thousands of miles so why wouldn't you want to look at it So it makes it easier to remember Bab Fahd and that's number 79. When you're inside the masjid, try to go, if you want to come out of the masjid, try to go towards the clock tower. Yeah, to the right of the clock tower and then you'll come out of this side. And then straight down, which street, what's the street called? Ibrahim Khalil. Ibrahim Al Khalil Road. Yeah, Ibrahim Khalil Road, everybody knows it. Right, when you're on Ibrahim Khalil Road, You're on, on the way to the hotel. Subhanallah, as we approach towards the beautiful Masjid Al Haram and make way to the entrances, as we get closer, I will most likely be turning my phone off. It's important that we pay our respect and adab to the sanctity of the Haram. But for now, please. Everybody enjoy the beautiful Nazarah.
guys so we've just completed uh, most of the steps of our umrah we've gone inside we've gone and done our tawaf then we've read our nafil as well as that we've then uh, headed off to Safa Marwa to complete the period the laps that we need to complete the seven times and now the last stage is it's is gonna go bold inshallah so the next time you'll see me is in the barber shop where we're going clean shave inshallah assalamu alaikum guys so hope you all well and like I said it's going all the locks time so we're in the barber shop you can see all the brothers are waiting and uh, it's that time so let's do it what are you saying Ifzad? <laughs> fully cut yeah So it's uh, finally happened. Uh, I am officially now a head. A couple of cuts on top, but we don't mind. Is there, brother? What are you saying? Good. Are we looking forward to the trip? Yeah. What are you saying? <laughs> Yeah, that feels weird. It feels very weird, though, you know. Yeah. Very weird. Proper weird. <laughs> I like it. He chopped you, bro. Assalamu alaikum, guys. So, the egghead is back and active. So, we've just finished uh, freshening up. So, the army is live here at Desi Chesi. You know what I'm saying? But not sure what I'm saying. The army is very set. And now, I'm going to go to the bar. I'm going to go to the bar. इंशाल्लाह उन कोई दिहाड़ी ना खाना तक नहीं क्योंकि आज रात ही इंशाल्लाह रमजान में ना शुरू हो सी या कल तक सां पर अगर आज रात ही शुरू है मतलब फिर रात ही तरावी है तो सुबह रोजा रखना है जी सो वाल्स वी कैंप वी गोना गो एंड हैव ट्राई बी एट द लोकल फूड एंड सी व्हाट द लोकल डेलिकेसीज � Asan Epai here wants to have some fresh fruit and veg first. He wants to uh, get their gains in. What are you saying, Shazim? Alright. Say it on What were you eating at 4 o'clock this morning? 
Woke up this morning, we had chicken burgers and chips. It's bad to say. Um, not feeling the best right now. Food wise, but. It was what we could find in the morning, I suppose, yeah, it? We had to make the best of a bad situation, unfortunately. Inshallah, we will now eat some uh, better food. Eh? Yeah. Right. Also, now that I've rested, um, for the ketchup wager and uh, talk a bit about my Umrah experience, really, I thought I'd tell you as well. Um, Umrah is not as hard as people make it out. I really, really don't know why they make it like it seems so. It's such a grand ordeal. It's, it's beautiful, it's simple, and it's not overly complex. Simple thing is, do you need it? <laughs> Go to the dwarf. Yes, it's a bit of a hustle, number of hustle, bustle, but that's part of the fun of it. It comes part and parcel with it, I suppose. Um, as well as that, then you've got uh, your nuffles, then you've got Safa Marwa, and then get the bold uh, look. And it's as simple as that. And then, is that what you think? How was Umrah? very good. Man. What do you think the process was like overall in general? A lot better than. Uh... But I think we got here quite a very quiet, not quiet time, but when the rush didn't kick in. So I that was alright. I think my favourite part was Safa Marwa though, you know, just in and out when the bits that you got through. run, gapping, gapping through, through innit? Yeah. We had a lot of fun doing that. And uh, it's, uh, you know, one of the beautiful things I think I found was we had uh, an elderly uh, an uncle with us, probably in his late 50s or early 60s at least. But they were giving us a run for the money as well, you know, uh, and literally going ahead running first and then us having to play chase and literally catch them up in the green light areas but um, it's that kind of spirit I suppose as well you know um, it adds a bit of fun to it uh, but also it just keeps us motivated as well it's uh, mid afternoon the streets are active and we're just doing a little bit of a walking tour through uh, Ibrahim Khalil Road uh, basically, this road was uh, named after Hazrat Ibrahim. The uh, reason being is that when he departed from his wife and uh, son, they walked in this path, so it was named after them for that reason. And now, our respect to the world also walks on this road, and the road leads towards Bakka al Mukarama. and we've come to um, the Star Khan restaurant where I ordered in a Bengali restaurant mutton biryani as you can tell that looks more like sunni chawal than biryani or anything uh, they've given me some hot sauce and some dry salad but chalo, it's, uh, it's not too bad it's edible and we'll enjoy it and the, the butters some of them are the shawarma so that's going to take a bit longer to make but the food it's, it's not great, but it's not bad. We'll probably give it about a 7 out of 10. Yeah, so what do you think? Ali rice. You know what? It's a bit spicy, but we'll try it out. You know what? It's not too bad. 7 out of 10. Anyway, we'll catch up inshallah later on. The one thing they won't tell you, well, you're in uh, Amaka, is when you go bald, your hair's like Velcro, take your clothes off, put a mask on, it just sticks to your head. It's very, very hard to take off. It is what it is. Um, we've just uh, had the announcement that um, Ramadan, uh, the blessed month, starts tomorrow, inshallah. So, inshallah, plan us today. Adam Sharif ne under um Dravi person. Asalaamu Alaikum guys, so we've just read Isha Namaz and uh, outside here now um we're off to go and have some dinner but just have a look at the hustle and the bustle at the back here. Busy 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 subpass are busy here come. Got 
There's money coaches is coming 24-7. I look this outdoor travel going on there, look. Going on as well. Shake today's the Shake today's today's. Subhanallah, just the hustle and the bus there. A city that never sleeps. Wow. <laughs> Outdoor travel happening, boys. These queues must be like so lines. Nearly a mile long. Everyone out on the streets praying. Wow. wow. Absolutely manic. house now and I'm having a uh, pizza hut behind me so that's where I've come for my lunch today um, I'm gonna have that for pretty much nighttime food and then inshallah after that might visit basket robins as well basket robins not basket robins what am I talking about um, I love that for my dinner today and then inshallah we need to wake up separately and have some uh, food proper food healthy food so like I said I'm having pizza so I've got myself that wedges some sauce and then these boys here, they've got some grilled chicken going on here. Shazay, what are you having? Same thing. Grilled chicken and brother Ifzal, what are you having? Burger. Burger and some chips there. Eh? Are you enjoying it? Where are we? What's this place? Maka Tower, isn't it? Maka Tower. So, sweet treat time. I ended up getting ice cream. We got um, some cookies and cream and pistachio. So that's my combination today. Enjoy Kursa and that's me done for the day. Heading back to the hotel. Might do a little bit of shopping whilst we're here before that. But um, yeah, that's the plan. And then we're from Sehri. And I think tomorrow we're going to Ziyarat, maybe potentially. So that's that's what's that's, well, that's basically the sketch for the day. tomorrow. Uh, it just depends on how it goes because I think there's a few people are still quite tight. It's been, it has been really long. So we're with the boys now, we're bargaining hard. Uh, that's it. What are you getting? Some zum zum spray. So it smells like the tower, the fragrance they're using here. Yeah. So that's what we're looking for now is spray. So they, they've got all these different ones which then they'll make in the different bottle sizes, whatever you want. So that's what they said. All the different sprays and perfumes they've got. They've got loads here. So I'm going to decide if I should get mine from Makkah or later on in Medina. I shall see how it goes, but um, ooh, this is my preference, so I do like something like this, maybe. 
I am tempted on something like that, inshallah. But you know, we'll see what I end up uh, purchasing maybe later on. These boys are a bit in a rush now to decide on what they want. Uh, look at that. Ramadan. Is it? You like it? Uh, yeah. What are you thinking? You got some testers? Testers, yeah. Which one? Still deciding. Still deciding. So, guys, I've done a bit of shopping for myself. I gave in to a bit of temptation. And I bought some ouds and a thirst for myself. They smell banging. So, I thought, you know what? Why not? We're here, so I uh, bought one uh, which is the fragrance very similar to Makam Ibrahim and another one very similar to um, Anakaba. So that's what I've got for myself. So, you know what? This smell quite good um, and mimic the smell. Obviously, they won't give you the original smell because I'm guessing that'll be like a secret or whatever it is how they do it. But so, you know what? It's close enough, it'll do for me and they make some nice little memories uh, when I spray them I was like oh you know what but when I went to Mecca and obviously inshallah they last a long while as well so for two or less do this uh, it's quite late one now inshallah we're just uh, shopping now with the boys still at the back they're buying some more stuff uh, and I think on the way back we need to just pick up some kajura and stuff for seri time uh, and iftari and then plan is get some sleep so over and out I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. This city ain't sleeping tonight, man. Everywhere we go, so much going on. Every angle. I'm going to go to the house. It's madness. Beautiful places, man. And good to be proud of our Islamic countries doing well. Inshallah. Salam alaikum, everybody. So, the beautiful month of Ramadan Kareem has now started. And uh, sister here is bypassed us, walking straight through the camera, but Tullah is all good. Uh, but the main thing is, is when you come here, the Makkah clock tower has a beautiful light. Uh, if you just pan to the top view, have a look. That light indicates to the whole city that Ramadan, the blessing, has now started. What a beautiful Nazara for the whole city to know. Coming here, little, little things just add up and you can see the clouds now slowly heading back. I think everyone's ready to Ravi's. People are having a bite to eat, a little bit of shopping. And then tomorrow morning, Sefi starts. Asalaamu Alaikum, guys. Hopefully, you're all well. Next part of the video, we're back. And Sefi is back to the Yad Pala, Rosari, Makam, Makarmavich. Then she'll turn her story cross on. Oh, okay, maybe not the angle. You'll see me stomach more than my food. So for the food, we have toast toast, scrambled eggs, juice, croissant, nothing similar for most of the boys. And uh, brother here has got jelly as well. <laughs> and now she's still there. Sari, now we're going to eat. Subhanallah, what a breakfast there. 